A student's return to school shows Pog Valley School is doing it right by answering our call to citizenship, wearing masks, remaining socially distant, and taking much needed mask breaks. What helps to make this challenging time easier is how positive students and staff are looking at the way we are now operating. Veteran teacher Scott Warcoven talked about how helpful technology has been to make sure all students feel engaged. This particular time right now that we're in, everybody needs to make some adjustments. We're all trying to do our part to, um, to help each other along. And, you know, we're fortunate that we have the technology and we have the webcams and we have the Zoom and we have Google Classroom and hopefully we are able to, you know, to reach those who are opting to stay out and to at least you know, hope to make them feel still included. As you walk through the halls and even on the bus, you will find students wearing masks and following proper social distancing guidelines. Well, the great thing is like, I walk into the classroom, I don't even have to ask my students, they automatically, um, you know, we, we spray down the tables, and they wipe down their, their workspaces, everyone is socially distanced, uh, six feet apart. With some students opting for distance learning, teachers are balancing teaching from the computer and in the classroom. Online learnings, learners, they have us. So I think they've done very well with, you know, being on top of the online learners and being on top of us. It's just kind of, it's one cohesive thing. Um, so it's been pretty good. It's definitely hard to not be able to have a normal senior year like a lot of us wanted to. Yeah. But, um... You know, I think the school is doing a really good job of trying to make it as normal as they can. Um, obviously, that comes with challenges because we can't really do as much as before. But I think they're doing a really good job to just try and make it feel as normal as it can be. Hi, I'm Kim Gallo. I'm going to take my mask off for a minute since it's only us in this room. My materials as a principal are different this year. Always on my desk are a measuring tape, a thermometer, and goggles. But I'll tell you the good parts. I'm enjoying taking your kids' temperatures every morning because every morning I need to spend my time with kids. I don't get bound up in the issues of the day. I get to greet kids, I get to see them, and I get to take their temperature. And they're awfully good about it. As you noticed, our students didn't focus on what is inconvenient about COVID, they focused on the fact that they are answering their call to citizenship, and they are doing that very well. While our plan is not perfect, because we don't travel in little cohorts, we make decisions in high school and in middle school about classes that we're going to take, things that enrich us, things that we're curious about. So, of course, that makes our plan somewhat imperfect, but we've done a very good job in zoning and cohorting our kids to the greatest extent possible, in keeping them safe by using safe measures and practices, and by the fact that we have such wonderful students. They really have been extremely cooperative in a very strange time. I'm so lucky to be their principal. Thank you.